Hey everyone, and we're back. My name is Miss Scarlet Tanager, and I'm playing some Fallout New Vegas. Now, you might have noticed that the screen got cut off there. Um, yeah, I had some weird issue with the recording, and a bunch of footage was unusable. But anyway, we're here. There's a dead guy. I am actually going to close that door, because we are not powerful enough to take on the two guys that are going to attack me if I go into that room. They have killed me every time. Or more, they killed Veronica, and then they killed me. And if they killed Veronica, I would have reloaded anyway. So we're gonna go do something that's less likely to get me murdered in my face. Such as going to go see the boomers or the cons or somebody else where I can have my guns and my weaponry. I rather like having my guns and my weaponry. The Legion better watch out now. Damn straight. Our rangers are going to turn the tables around. Sure, the rangers. We need to get a slightly higher sneak skill so I can sneak my holdout weapons in here. That's pretty much what's going on. Yeah, I got my stuff back. Having your stuff is always a very good thing, especially when it's weapons, when there are people who want to kill your face everywhere. So, who should we go see next? The boomers or the great cons? Let's see here. If I can remember how to play, that is. Damn it, controller. Hmm. Wild card side bets. That's all the way out here. There's the boomers. And that was Air Force Base. There's the cons, I think, but I can't remember who's all the way down here. Okay, let's go see the boomers, I guess. I hate you, game. I love you, but I hate you sometimes. No other person has been inside the lucky... It had been 200 years since anybody had been inside the lucky 38, then how come it was so clean? And, you know, working. And stuff. Either way, I think I'm going this way. Yep. We're following this marker. Come on, V, we're going on an adventure. One that doesn't get you murdered in your face. Which totally didn't happen. You guys don't you guys don't even get to see that because all of the footage is corrupted. But yeah, Veronica died. Twice. But we're not gonna let you die, are we, honey buns? We're not gonna let you die, are we? Mwah. Okay. I'm not entirely sure how I'm actually supposed to get up there. I think it's over here. It's a little, like, uh, up ramp or something, and then we just gotta really stick to the side of the area because there are bombs! So many bombs! I think they want to kill me. Can I take these? Can I take any of these? Balls. I wanted corn. Uh oh. Uh oh. Wait, why do I- Why do I only have my fists? Um, I guess I accidentally sold my weaponry, but... So I guess we're using a plasma rifle. Attack me, I dare you. Attack me, I dare you. You're gonna attack me. Okay, I guess you get to die then. Have fun! Boof. Boof. Am I, am I wearing a freaking rad suit right now? That's enough of that. Okay, then that just happened. I'm wearing a rad suit. I am, I'm wearing a freaking space suit. No! Sure, I'll wear Boone's beret. Why the hell not? How do I look? Do I look spiffy? I don't know, I can't see myself. There we go. I look all kinds of spiffy. No, we'll see the front. No, we'll see the front. Um. No. No. Oh, balls. I right, go for wasting my weaponry. Can't remember how to play a game. Oh well. Sneak, 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 sneak. Oof. As long as nothing tries to kill me in my face, we're gonna be okay. We're gonna be okay gonna be okay. 
probably not going to be okay. <laughs> I'm going to die, and then Veronica's going to die in reverse order, so Veronica dies first, and then I have to reload because Veronica died, but then I died before I can reload. So there's just going to be a lot of death. So much death. A bunch of dying, too. But mostly death. Okay, I think I have to... What the hell are you? What the hell are you? Hi! Whoa there, pal. You better slow down, or you'll get blown up like the rest of the idiots who thought they'd scavenge in Boomer territory. Now that I've got your attention, might you be interested in a little information? It'll cost you, but it's well worth the investment. Depends on how much. You can tell me, or you can tell the answers on my boot. Whoa, simmer down. <laughs> I'll tell you. I'm a gambler and a scavenger. I've made some cash from gambling and some cash from reclaiming goods that are no longer being used. So thievery. Now, do you want my help or not? Sure, why not? Thanks for the warning. Uh, what's going on past the signs? Oh, lordy, lordy. You haven't heard of the boomers? Mm, apparently what no, have but you been I have. Under? They're a bunch of artillery slinging, grenade lobbing odd jobs camping out in Nellis. Wander into their territory and you're as good as mincemeat. Is there any way to get past? There is a way, and I'll tell you. For a little wager. A wager? Well, I know the secret to get past. If you give me the caps, I'll tell you. If you make it back alive, I'll double your money. Ooh. Nah. Suit yourself. I can do this. Why not? I'll do it. <laughs> But before I do it, let's save. Because he would probably stab me in the back and not double my money, is what I'm assuming happens. Because that's the way these games generally run. Saving, 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 save. Savey, 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 save. Save, 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 save. He's gonna get blown up. He's gonna get blown up. He's gonna get blown up. I'm gonna laugh when he gets blown up. Ow. 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 Holy shit, it's actually hitting me, but it's not doing much damage. I knew I should have been an actress. It'll be okay, V. It'll be okay. See, there's the Air Force Base over there. You okay, V? You okay, V? Come on, V. Don't worry about it. We'll get we'll get through this. I can't remember which side or which area I want to get through to get through there, but if I know that if you like hug one end, you'll get through. Oh, honey, 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 you're the stim pack. You're the last person we need to get killed. I need to find a doctor, though. <laughs> Hopefully, there's a doctor in the Nellis Air Force Base. Because if not, I might be in a smidgen of trouble. You think after all the people wanting to scavenge from Nellis, they would have run out of artillery shells a while ago, but apparently not. Hello. Hi guys. You got a rocket? Hold it right there. Don't kill Don't me. You move. Don't kill me. How the hell did you survive that bombardment? Epicness. Um, simple enough. Run, hide, run. It's all in the timing. But I had you zeroed in the whole time. Nobody's that fast. I'm badass. Move a muscle now and I'll blow you to pieces. I didn't come here to attack you. Then just... just stay where you are. Raquel will be here any second. Okay. I'll take this from here. Hi, I'm I Raquel, can't see Master you! I'm Master at Arms for the Nellis Homeland. Mother Pearl, our eldest, wishes to speak to you. Cool! Alright, lead the way. Follow close, and mind your behavior. I can't see you, but... So I have no idea who the hell's bales ya. Welcome, child. Yeah. Took your sweet time getting here, didn't you? Hey! I've been waiting a good five years for an outsider to come along and visit. Then why were you blowing everything up? You weren't exactly rolling up the red carpet. Those howitzers of ours aren't just for entertainment, child. Explosive ordnance is what keeps the savages at a distance. Except you. There's something special about you, child. And it was the howitzers that gave you a chance to show it. Okay, then. Oh, so many ways. Small ones to begin with, so we can get used to what it's like to have a sav- 
uh, outside or around. A savage. And, you were going to call me a savage. Should you that were go call me well, it, savage, maybe honey you can help in big ways, too. We'll have to see. Well, how can we trust each other if you're going to be keeping secrets? You have to keep in mind that you're our first contact with the outside world since I was barely a woman. Seclusion has kept us safe. And probably inbred. The world around us is changing. Neon lights in the distance. I'm gonna go Patrolling up robots, soldiers. My youngers think our guns can keep out the world. But I think we need to let it in just a little or become its victim. You're that little bit of the world, child. Welcome to Nellis. Uh, where do I start? You picked a good time to stop by, for we're swimming in problems. My youngers can tell you all Great. about it. Now I have to fix Raquel everyone's could use help with the problem. bug problem. Doc Argyle has wounded he's tending to. Ooh, I need a doctor. And Loyal and Jack might be looking for help with some repairs. Or you could just go see Pete at the museum and hear the story of our people. All you have to do there is listen. Oh, great. Come and go as you and like, I'm help or don't I? help, I leave it up to you. But I hope you'll show my youngers that not every outsider needs to be blown up. Hello. 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 So we're going to go see if we can help some people out, because I like to help people out, and helping people out is a very, very nice thing to do. It is a nice thing to does. And then hopefully we'll get some experience points so I can get higher sneaks so I can keep my holdout weapons in the casinos. Uh, contact the boomers to spend and tell them that the boomers can be ignored. Um, going over here? I don't know where I'm going. I'm going in here. Nope, that's an Ellis Woman's Rex, and I don't think I have to go over there yet. Oh, let's follow the little symbols on my map. That's helpful. If they've been here that long, they're probably dealing with some incest issues. Because incest, when you don't have a lot of contact with the outside world, is a thing that kind of happens sometimes. I'm following- wait, no, I'm following the wrong markers, aren't I? <laughs> Let's equip the right quest, shall we? Um, Blair. There we go, that's better. Is there anything in the men's barracks? Anything at all? Does not seem to be so. Might be something in the women's barracks though. Let's take a look at our local map. Um, nope, it's just outside. The Nellis Schoolhouse. So what are they teaching these kids? I wonder, wonder, wonder. Hello? Watch your steps, sister. Hey, don't you be yelling at me! Oh wait, no, I wasn't actually supposed to go into the schoolhouse. <laughs> I'm a silly. Wee 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 wee. Uh oh. I hope I didn't just mess up my recording. Eee, that'd be bad. Messing up your recording is a bad thing. Okay. I will know once I finish this whether or not I just balls up my recording on accident. I hit a button when I shouldn't have hit a button. Oh well. Hello. You have a problem? Argo. I know Mother Pearl is letting you wander Nellis as you please, outsider. But I have patience to tend to. You need help. I have three patients here who were gravely injured fighting those giant ants in the generator building a few days ago. I've okay. stabilized their wounds, but they're in bad shape. Do you have medical training? Um. Oh my god. Well, I don't know, actually. I suppose it's possible. You should take a look. <laughs> I just bullshit my way through that. That's awesome. Yes, outsider? I need medical treatment. I'm afraid medications are insured. Balls. But my everything is pain. Pr 
proper treatment. Uh, leave him alone. <laughs> What's my medicine right now? <laughs> um, stats. Nope! <laughs> my medicine is not up to snuff at the moment. Leave him alone. We'll need to find some medical magazines. Oh dear, yeah, that's not happening. Maze. Cool. Okay, not much I can do in there just yet because we need to make sure that we have enough medicine so I don't accidentally murder someone in their face. Because murdering someone in their face is rather bad for them and kind of a mean thing to do. I also really, really need to find a doctor. <laughs> Maybe I'll go all the way back to Good Springs and go, Doc! Doc, I need your help! My everything is pain! Now let's meet- oh no, now we're gonna have to listen to this guy drone on and on and on about the history, isn't it? Aren't I? Hi, Pete. You're the outsider. Yep. Mother Pearl sent word that you'd be stopping by. You must be eager to hear the story of our people. Not really. Me? I'm Pete, keeper of the story. I know I seem kind of young. I was the apprentice keeper of the story until a couple months ago, but old keeper Don, well... He got blown up. Whiskey and landmines don't go together. Yep. <laughs> so it's up to me. I bet you want to know everything about us. Not really, but sure. Wonderful. I'm sure you've noticed the mural on the wall of this hut. Shall I tell you what it all means? Uh, sure. Excellent. Imagine you're the first outsider to ever hear our tale. <clears throat> oh, hi! Mural. <laughs> Did not even see that. Ages ago, long before I was born, we lived underground. Okay. Everyone had guns, but the overseer wouldn't let us explode anything. Not even a hand grenade. Okay. So you lived in a vault. We left and wandered the wastes. They were savages with knives. We blew them up with frag mines and grenades. <laughs> and them with flamethrowers. Yes. It was neat. But there was a downside. For every 43.6 savages we killed, we lost one of our own. We needed 43. a new 43.6 savages? They lost one of theirs? Really? <laughs> Not much of a downside. Here we have prospered and multiplied. Here our mighty guns destroy and any incest, savages right? who might try to harm us before they can even reach our gates. Well, until... Me. But... Ah. Not saying you want to harm us or you're a hey. savage, but anyways... Don't you? Don't you Nellis start. has revealed many secrets. Got guns, kid. It has taught us how to fly the bombers once based here. Ooh, and really? it has taught us where to find one. Ooh. You're gonna want me to find you a freaking bomber, aren't we? Aren't you? Great. And that is our story so far. For this last image is our future. To restore the bomber, Ooh. to fly the old disguise in armored safety, bringing high explosive ordnance upon ignorant savages. This is our destiny. I'm pleased that you listened to the that entire story. That really creepy. Perhaps there are details you'd like to know more about. Let me know. Yay, boomer thinking. So we need to help them out before they'll tell me to go do something to help them repair the boomer? The, 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 or bomber. The bomber. Which is a gigantic plane of raining fire from the sky. Yay, fire. Yay, fire. Blow the things up. Blow the things up. Blow the things up. And then everything can die in its face. Okay, yeah, first time I gotta do in these places. Good to know. And whoop. Munition storage. Can I blow up the Nellis Air Force Base? <laughs> Just set all of the explosions or explosives to explode. It's like, no, nope, screw you guys. But that would be mean, and I'm not mean. <coughs> cough, cough. There doesn't seem to be a lot of guys here. Whiskey. Oh, Sunset Sasparilla bottle. What do they drink? And your hair is so white. Okay. You the chef? Oh, ooh, ooh. I see. I see a thing. I see a thing. It's moving. It's moving. Where is it? It's over here? Wait, no. Wait, huh? 
I thought there was something inside here I wanted me to go see. Urkel. What? Okay, fine. I guess there was nothing in here I needed. I thought there was. I thought there was. Oh well. <sighs> Yawn. Okay. Sorry, so. no time to talk, outsider. Good. I didn't want to talk to you. Go away. If I help them make a bomber, does that mean that I'll get to? Oh, don't tell me they're gonna try and put that back together. I can't remember. It's like, do you guys really want to put that back together? That doesn't seem very safe. Or sanitary. Let's go see if I can go on it. Can I go on it? Oh, I can go on it! <laughs> ah, ah, ah. I'm on a bomber. I'm gonna sit on the gun turret and go... Brrr. Oh, no! No, I was trying to pretend I was firing the gun turret. Veronica, you run hella fast, honey. Okay, enough, enough messing around. Where's the dude I need to talk to? Hi there! Need some help? I'm good at that. Hey. Hey. So you're the outsider. Lived your whole life out there, huh? Mm-hmm. Wow. Thanks. I always thought you savages probably spoke a different language. But I hear you sound like us. Um... I'm not a What I could savage. use is some scrap metal. <clears throat> It may not sound exciting, but around here we have to recycle every rivet and plate. Okay. The other thing, you being from the outside and all, well, I guess you'd call it a personal matter, but, well, uh, forget it. Nope, 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 what is it? That must be nice, sharing yourself like that, not being embarrassed or anything. Well, the thing is, there's this girl. Really? Oh, you can't miss her. She has short red hair, and she's the most beautiful woman who ever lived. You'd really talk to her for me? What if she feels the same way? What if she comes here like you did? What if she gets blown up? What if she what gets if she blown doesn't up? Like me? <laughs> oh, jeez. Uh, I better just let you handle it. I'm better with machines. They don't make my stomach queasy like this. Okay, so I'll look into it. Stranger, stranger things have happened. That would be amazing. So there's this As girl in, that he saw through some kind of like forever. view screen that he's never actually met that he's apparently in love with. Okay, let's set him up, I guess, or something. So there's that one. Love birds, yay! That is also the end of this video. My name is Miss Garthanager, and I am playing some Fallout in Vegas. I'll see you all.